Howdy, y'all. It's Ryan from RNA Music, your favorite mom pop guitar shop music lesson studio, and it's surprise new stuff day. I don't even know what this is, but let's find out together. I hope it's not a severed head. I would be very disappointed. Welcome back. I'm Ryan from RNA Music. Little mom and pop guitar shop music lesson studio extraordinaire in a small town in East Texas. We make videos about stuff and things, and today it's an unboxing of which I have no idea what it is. Normally, when we do unboxings, obviously I know uh, what's in the box because I ordered it. I did not order this box, so I don't know what it is. Ugh. Let's not slice our hand open, Ryan. That'd be great. From time to time, some of our amazing YouTube subscribers and social media followers and people will send us stuff. So I'm <laughs> sure that that's what this is. All right. Some books. All right. Overcoming Life's Challenges. That would be a good book to read. This is from uh, Ken Rogers, Letters of Paul. I like that. We got some, oh, nice. Ah. A car. It's, I think this is Christmas, Christmas slash birthday. It's my birthday is uh, day after tomorrow. Whoa. It's a card for me. Happy birthday. It is my birthday. Wishing you a day of happiness and a year of fantastic journeys. Happy birthday, Ryan. Ken Rogers. Thank you, Ken. <laughs> Man, that's awesome. I appreciate that. I'm gonna open this one on behalf of the family. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to all the Molly. All right, well, I'm opening everybody's Christmas present for them. Thank you, Ken. We got some books. Got a sweet calendar. David Grant. You can never have too many calendars. I, I, I'm, have reached middle age where I cannot keep track of what day it is. Thank you for the calendar. We got these, we got one like in every room. Oh, nice. So we got a lot of scriptural stuff. Courageous faith. Finding hope. Oh, that's a good one. Dealing with a, uh, Dealing, I know this one. It's dealing with uh, grief, basically. Thank you for that. My uncle passed away a few months ago, and so that is useful. Grandmother's prayers, prayer books. What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, Angela will like that one. Prophecy, end time prophecy stuff. She likes prophecy stuff. Man, awesome. Thank you, Ken. Little emotionals. <laughs> this whistle key finder. <laughs> whistle. The key finder will answer you and help you find your keys. Yeah, I need that. I might actually have to give this to my dad because my dad keeps losing his keys. Although, this would come in useful for me. I freaking love this. You can never have too many microfiber cloths. Ken sends me boxes of microfiber cloths. I use this at the shop cleaning guitars, and I think this is that's what's up. Some Dr. Squatch soap. <laughs> I've gotten some of this before from Ken. Thank you, Ken. This stuff, this stuff's good. If you've never tried the Dr. Squatch, it's some good stuff. It's really nice. So lots of books, calendar, some soap. Thank you, Ken. I appreciate that. That is incredibly thoughtful. You know, getting something in the mail, even just a letter or a postcard these days, is kind of a lost art, it seems like. I was talking to Angela a couple days ago about like, hey, we should make some Christmas cards, like r and Music Christmas cards to send out to our students and customers and, and friends and family. And, you know, we should do that. It might be a little late. Today is December the, what is it? December the 14th. 
A little late. We'd have to have a maid today and mail tomorrow, maybe. I don't know. But yeah. So uh, occasionally, occasionally, you guys and girls out there in the internet land will send us stuff. Doesn't have to be expensive things or whatever. I mean, these books, uh, we've gotten cards. I've gotten letters written. Some of you guys have written letters to us. And uh, just, you know, just a handwritten letter saying, hey, appreciate what you do. Thank you for the positivity. I've got those. I have a stack of letters I keep in my office that I'm like, from, from people that we've connected with online. So I encourage you, if you haven't written a letter lately to a loved one, you know, a relative or a friend, even just go get a freaking postcard and handwrite a note on it and mail it to them. You'll be surprised. Maybe you won't be surprised how that can really change somebody's day. So uh, thank you, Ken. Appreciate this. Amazing. Uh, very much. Thank you, man. From the bottom of my heart, I appreciate that. I'm going to share this stuff. Angela will be here a little bit later uh, to get ready for teaching lessons. And I will show this stuff to her. Thank you, Ken. Appreciate that. Yeah. You guys, we'll see you in the next video. Until then, keep the music alive. Don't forget it. The music needs you. We need the music. We need to take a bath. <laughs> and uh, let's keep it alive for the next generation. All right. Thank you, Ken, so much. Appreciate it. You guys, go out there, get a card, write something in it, and give it to somebody you care about. I'm just telling you, you're, you're going to feel amazing, and they're going to feel super amazing. All right. See you guys soon.